Okay, I didn't want to make a video on this laptop anymore because of the bad sound quality and the whole thing. Um, I just hope it's recording right now. Uh, let me enlarge that a little bit so you can see. You can see what I see. And we go... Oh, that's a little bit too much. Let's go 16 here. All right. So you can see that now. Okay, that's good. So I edited uh, with nano is my editor nano space forward slash etc forward slash default forward slash wicked wicd then you go into that and i switched uh, start demons it was set to no so i switched it to yes that was number one i did so independent of this i uh, went into the control center into session user desktop session and here you see again I can't make that bigger wicked client I uh, uncomment uh, took, the, took the pound sign off and then in the second line grab blah 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 start daemon I equals I put that to yes too and if I see that right or if I see that right it is actually the ed etc forward slash default forward slash wicked so I don't know which one you really need. Uh, having edited both files, I got Wicked running here right now and it auto connects now. So it doesn't ask me at boot up anymore for uh, the root password. It's doing a good job. And with Plunk I did the same, right? So I just show you guys. So I went into control center, session, uh, user desktop session. And the file I'm editing is called startup. So when I go here, brrr, I just put in startup plank. So a pound sign, space, startup plank. That's what I wrote. Then I put plank, space, and I put the, uh, oh, what's it, this merchandise plus sign, or whatever you call it. I have no idea. But that's very important that you put that on the end. Um, did it with Redshift, but Redshift didn't behave well. It doesn't do it just like that so I created my personal menu to have easier access so you don't have to go to all these things and search and find it no search and find mission so having said this I've got now 90% done of what I wanted to do uh, connect shares I think I put that in my personal menu here too you see connect shares so I'll click on that attempting to connect dun, 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 dun. the following shares are mounted that didn't work at boot up why I have no idea but here I am now, the ran, it's all there. That is not such a big deal with the shares because, yeah, I mean, the whole thing is not really the big thing. Usually I let this laptop run and run and run and run and run. However, um, I would like, I would wanted to see Plank booted up automatically. I wanted to have my network connection done. So these are the most important parts. But Redshift, I haven't worked out yet. And I worked that out with the Antiques Forum. So here I was, the Antiques Friends, blah, blah, blah. So no blazing guns this time because I tested them already with blazing guns and they behaved very, very well. Um, and then the member, Caprea, oh, again, him. Yeah, he did that before. He helped me before. And so he said, the question with Wicked was asked quite often, maybe should be mentioned in the FAQ because I checked FAQ and I checked tips and tricks. I couldn't find it there. So and then he just uh, referred my referred, referred to this chat or post in their forum and there it was. So Larish gave the answer and then it worked. So open terminal tab. So he did it here. So I don't know if you have to do both or single file. I don't know. I did both. Works fine. I'm totally fine with that. Most likely it will work if you just use um, etc default wicket. So, I mean, yeah, you can use a leaf pad if you have, or you use nano whatsoever. Um, I will copy that with nano, I change that to nano, <coughs> and uh, put that in this video description. So, I hope that helps somebody who is struggling to get Plank or a Docky or whatever auto loaded when you boot up your antiques. And I mean, wicket, it should do it automatically, it should come like that, we, you know, guys. Right, it should, it should, it really, really should. So, I cut that video off here. I hope it helps. It's just a very short uh, help video. I hope it helps. 
If it helps one person, then job well done. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching and see you soon. Bye bye bye.